All right, guys, welcome back to some more Final Fantasy 16. Hope you are all doing well. And welcome back to what I think is the Bahamu boss fight. We're about to find out what's behind the door. Is someone there? Arthur. It's you. What happened to you? He, he tried to take him from me. Oh, my boy. My darling, darling boy. Is this the child you made with the Emperor? Why, Mother? Why did you betray us all? You have no right! <gasps> Answer him! We took you in, Savage. Show some respect for those who raised you! <sighs> Honorable Elwyn, always thinking of his precious homeland. But what worth is a homeland in a world beset by the Blight? Father did not seek to protect his country. He sought to protect his people. A leader's duty is not to protect his people. It is to protect the source of his sovereignty, the noble blood that runs in his family's veins. So long as this bloodline remains unbroken, what does it matter if a nation falls? One can always found another. Unlike him, I did my duty. I preserved my line. I bore a son of the noblest blood, to whom the whole world might kneel. That is why I gave Rosaria to Sambrek, that I might join my line with the Lasages and birth a savior of this benighted land, blessed by both Bahamut and the Phoenix! You sold your country for a child. Why did he need another? You had Joshua. I had nothing. You were always your father's son, so very strong and bold and daring. And yet you failed to awaken. Would that Joshua had been granted a tenth of your strength. Oh! How the nobles laughed that Elwyn's firstborn was surely the son of a concubine, and my own not long for this world. The shame of it. The shame of being slandered by one's inferiors. How could you ever know how that feels? It should have been you! Why didn't the Phoenix choose you? She was every waking moment was men trying to shoulder the burden that you and the Phoenix and the Duchy foisted on him. That's why I became his shield. To help bear the weight. But what did you do? You betrayed your own blood and surrendered your son to his fate! Joshua. My darling boy. I never meant to hurt him. The soldier's orders were clear. He was to be spared. Why did you survive when the only one I truly cared for died? What? Have you not looked out of the window? Joshua is here. The Phoenix lives on. He's battling Bahamut as we speak. Joshua! Wake up! I am a shield of Rosaria. And I will do my duty. What are you...
this is what we fucking insane. Fights are so insane. Oh. Or reversed. Oh, I think I need to move. Oh, Joshua is back. Joshua! No! My brother alone! You've learned spit flare. Clive has learned the ability Spit Flare from Bahamu. Press R2 and Triangle to release a massive stream of light to see as anything in its path. What the hell? Extended exposure to the flare will cause enemies to become partially staggered, cancelling any initiated abilities. Maintaining the flare for its maximum duration will result in an enhanced finishing explosion. Oh my god, this is all insane. Bit flare. Don't do this. Giga flare. No. 
Oh no, we're playing this. Embodying the Phoenix again, controls the Phoenix as well as move, fight, air, charge, evade. Do you list? Mega flat. This is so cool. again. Oh shit, that hurts. Flat. Get these things out as quick as possible. Come on, not make a flare. Don't be dodging. Thunder. Those things are growing in more ether than I've ever seen. 
Come on. Need to got it. Nice. Oh, you know he ain't going away yet. I can really hit him for now until I get my spit flare back. Nice. So epic. Oh, 
Nice, we did it. I didn't. I thought there was gonna be more. To be fair, that was cool. And we definitely made the right choice to split the videos up. Going all mighty morphing power rangers on him. Here comes the mega flare again. Are you ready? Ready. You know, I didn't think it was gonna be over. Embodying Ifrit Risen. No way. In addition to Wildfire, Ifrit Risen also has access to the ability Light Speed, which is similar to Phoenix Shift, allows for swifter approach. This is just insane, like. How can we hope to match such power? <laughs> oh, this is insane. By trusting in our own. Let's go.
nice. Come on, Molly, stagger. Hundred and six. Is that hundred and sixty eight thousand? Radiance. Oh shit. Celestial Foundry. Oh my word, what is that? the attack he's ready in a terror flare gotta break him come on come on come on come on nice I can't get out. Nice. I don't think I'm doing any more damage to him. I think I've got to the point where I've damaged him enough. There's going to be a little cinematic. Yeah. Zeta Flare. Now he's defeated. Oh, honestly, that was so good. Light shard. Craft of material. Nice.
Joshua! My Clive! My brother. I... I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. You're alive. We both are. Nothing else matters. I never dared hope that I would see this day. Reunited at last. Jill. It is done. The demon that would tear our house apart is no more. Father. <laughs> the Mother Crystal. It's collapsing. Right. We need to leave. No. Wait. I owe him a debt. Fine. Can nothing be done to call them off? I regret not, Your Radiance. The Dragoons answer to none but His Imperial Highness. The Council is powerless to intervene. Madness is this, Theon. Focus all efforts on extinguishing the fires around the capital. The city can wait. Don't dally, man! Go! Your Radiance! By the light, Dion, have you taken leave of your senses? Call off the dragoons at once. Fear not, the populace will come to no harm at their hands. I am here to save you, father. Save me. A creeping darkness hides in the heart of Sanbrek. It stems from your wife, the traitorous Annabella. Not another word, Dion. Father, though you may not see it, 
The darkness has taken hold of you. It has made you forget yourself. But I bid you remember, there was a time when you ruled not with cruelty, but with compassion. Why now do you turn your back on your people? Why now do you seek to stoke the fires of war? You too have borne witness to this change, your eminences. And you know, as well as I, who is responsible for it. A puppet now sits upon the throne, but cut his strings and the master loses the power! What? Tion, you bear steel before your emperor? Guards! Take him! For every citizen who falls, another can be bred. For every home that burns, another can be built. Those were your words. But when the last of your citizens has fallen, and all of their homes have been reduced to ash, what will become of your empire? Of its rulers? Of your god? As the mother crystals crumble one by one, and the blight sweeps in to claim all that we hold dear, our people look to their emperor for protection. Yet he labors not to secure their futures, but to seize what is left of the twins for himself. Even if it should come at the cost of everything his loyal citizens have labored to build. Dion, you must understand. A small price to pay. Is it not? You've been blessed with great power, Dion. Enough to win me the world. So go, claim Valestia for me, brother. Father, how he doted on his children. That he would die to protect me was plain. It was but a matter of when. You planned this? You did well to endure so long. But you broke in the end, as I knew you would. And now Muthos approaches. Put him to the proof. I would see if he breaks. Go, Bahamut. Kin Slayer. story. You cannot stay here, mother. Come. Take my hand.
mother. If it is consciousness that weaves your wills together. Consciousness that blurs the boundary between your own will and that of others. Then we shall set you apart once more. The ties that bind you shall be severed and humanity return to its proper place. By primogenesis shall a new age of reason begin. Relax, your majesty. Don't you want to play? It's been a long time. If that is your wish. Men, you are as meek as all the others. Such feeble creatures. Gifted the power of icons, yet slaves to fickle emotions which usher you to your doom. And so you bind your fragile wills with strands of consciousness. The wretched handiwork of a wretched people. The sons of fire were united at last, and for but a moment. Their flame burned bright. Soon, Muthos shall become our perfect vessel. And then shall the world be remade. Not before the bonds are severed. Of trust, of respect, of love. Only when every strand of consciousness is cut away, may Muthos return to our side. By primogenesis shall all be undone. Mankind shall be rid of his wretchedness and Muthos of his will. But while he yet clings to it, he has the power to forge bonds anew. And so we bid you. Find Muthos and sever everyone. To destroy that which has no physical form, you ask the impossible. There is nothing your black blade cannot cut, Odin. We shall unite with Muthos and bring forth a new world. So long as our vessel remains unclaimed by humanity. It shall be done, Master. My will is yours.
this is all getting super confusing. Right, back to the hideaway. As usual, when we've done one of these. We've now also absorbed Bahamut. So we should have some more abilities. How is your brother? Asleep, since I returned from the Dominion. Taya says he should be back on his feet soon enough. For a while, at least. She discovered something on his chest. A swelling, circled in stone. Curse. For every mountain we climb, another arises up to greet us, doesn't it? It's never ending. Even the sky seems to have grown tired of it all. <sighs> Things fall apart. Now here we go. Clive has claimed a portion of the icon Bahamut's essence. To begin casting Mega Flare. That's kind of crazy. Right, well, I'll tell you what, while we've got time, guys, just at the end of this, we'll go and have a look round at everything that's new. While he rests, I might as well see what Otto has to say. Right, we've got some on the wall of memories. Oh, Sid's Goblet Eye. That's what we took last time. Well, we took that a few episodes ago now. Miraculously undamaged in the attack on the old hideaway, Otto held onto the featureless clay cup to remind him of his lost friend. Oh. Let's have a look what mail we've got. About the other day. <laughs> Greetings from the Crimson Caravans. Curse Breaker Intelligence. Quite the mess. <laughs> right. Has Blackthorn got anything new? Yes, he has. So, what it be? Bright burn. Oh, better than what I've got. It last you a good so while. Best believe we're crafting it. Um. Oh. Oh, that's what that oracal comes for. We need stained loincloth and marble flower. Oh, they look insane as well. The sons of Uro Uroboros. I think that's how you say it. Anything else? Right, that's like nothing. We don't really care about this. Um. Karen, what have you got? Still alive, are you? What's she got new? Ah. Oh. Oh, so not nothing really, just materials. Oh! Last elixir. No way. Upon KO, automatically restores all HP, fills limit gauge, and increases attack power. 
I'll carry one of them round with us. Better I'll be here. That's pretty sick, Seems actually. I'm quite used to hearing that one. Um. Right, yes, we've got Renown, I think, as well, to collect, like, the reward. Do you know what? I should have went to Harpocrates while I was there. Damn it. Right, Vivian. What will it be today? What is Nothing it that you I just want to get that off, thanks. Very good. Oh, can I get the renown? What the hell? I thought it was 800 and odd. How may I help you today, Clive? Come to claim your just desserts. Oh, it's 900. Oh, are you kidding me? Five away. Never mind. Best of luck out there, Sid. Right, Nectar. New hunts, nice. The Ten of Clubs. From uh, Dalmechia. Right, I'm gonna have to make it. I'll make a note of these for the next episode, guys. The my the Mageth Mageth brothers, Quiet Sands, Rosaria, Thirty Renown, nice. And Ruin Reawakened, oh, another S rank. Sambraqua Legend, Tales of a Dread Dragon. Right, is this another one where it's, we're gonna struggle to find it? It's like we're just gonna have to try and narrow it down. Right. Well, I've made a note anyway of... It must be somewhere in Sam Breck. Um, I've made a note of them too anyway. We'll go and see Harpocrates and then we'll leave it there. There's talk of these skies driving deep. I haven't spoken to Harpocrates in a while where you're like... Um, what's it? Where you're like... Pass them all your knowledge on and that, and that little level bar thing goes up. I haven't done that for a few. A few videos, man. I was wondering when next you'd visit. I have compiled some new right, entries. If you would like to see them. Nice. Oh, I got a trophy as well. It's a rather fascinating excerpt I've been meaning to show you. Sorry, I, I can't. I can't be bothered to read them. How about I should be happy to answer it. Right, I'll run over to Watto, and then I'll stop it there. Just for when I come back, I'm, I'm right. Oh, actually, no, I don't need to because we're not speaking to Watto. We're going to go and get them hunts. Right. Well, we'll leave it there then. In that case, guys. So, thank you so much for watching, as always, everyone. If you could like the video and subscribe to the channel, I'd really, really appreciate it. And I hope wherever you all are, you're having a wonderful day. And I'll see you on the next one. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.